Hi everybody, we are here in Allentown, Pennsylvania at Community Bike Works, which is an awesome organization. And this is James, who is the program manager. And I want you to tell everybody what Community Bike Works is. Well, what Community Bike Works is, is a youth development organization for ages 9 to 17 that aims to influence the students' outlook about school and life while they're in the program. And it's called Community Bike Works, and we have all these cool tools and bikes all around us. And so what do you do here? Um, the, the mission is to keep the kids engaged while they're here, so we offer a 12-week program that they can actually earn a bike from us. That's awesome, and they're fixing it and building it? That's right, they're learning all of the mechanics throughout the program, so they don't have to know anything when they start. I love this, and now you, we're, we're talking about bikes, but we also have some food here, and so this is because they, they actually get snacks here every day, right? That's right, yeah, they do get snacks every day, and it's good to see some healthy food sitting in front of us, so that you know the kids can be served well in that way. Yeah, and you know we wanted to make like a really super quick, fast, healthy snack, and also make it allergy friendly because everybody has like peanut allergies or soy allergies, and uh, we also wanted to make sure that it was food that was accessible. So you know we have here some oranges, some bananas. You can find them pretty much in any like corner market or any grocery store, no matter where you live. And so we're gonna make a super simple smoothie, um, but it's not all fancy schmancy. It's just some fruit and some vanilla for a little added flavor. It kind of tastes like a creamsicle, actually, like those creamsicle popsicles, right? But it's all fresh stuff. So I'm gonna peel an orange and I'm gonna ask you to do the same. And while we're doing that, <laughs> let's talk a little bit more about the program. So um, so what happens when somebody signs up for Community Bike Works, what do they do when they start? Um, they'll come in and they'll be assigned to a group. So we have four different workstations and within each workstation, they'll be paired up with staff members and volunteers. Um, so once the program actually begins, they'll choose a bike that they want. Mm -hmm. And all of our bikes are donated from anybody. So it can wow. be in any size, any condition, and the, the students will actually choose their specific bike. And then throughout the 12 weeks, they're learning about the different parts of the bike and fixing it so that after the program, they can take it with them and it belongs to them. Well, a really cool thing you had mentioned too is this, this journal thing, right? Where when kids come in, you kind of ask them some questions and have them write their answers, and then you compare and contrast that to the answers when they leave the program? That's right. Um, so when they come in the first day, they're given their very own journal. So that's our way of logging their progress and also teaching them you know, certain writing abilities and things like that, kind of adding on to what they're learning in school. And we also make them take a couple of tests. So we take a safety pre-test and a safety post-test to gauge what they learned while they were in the program. I love that. Well, this is awesome. We're gonna finish this drink right now so we can share it with everybody and then uh, learn a little bit more and see what you guys are doing. So, all right, let's see, what do we have here? We have two oranges, two bananas, and we're just, we're kind of making a lot right now. Um, but I, I remember when I was in programs after school and we always had oranges and bananas all the time and apples, but the apples were gross. So I didn't want to use any, <laughs> any apples. So oranges and bananas. All right, and this is just some water and I'm gonna add a little bit of vanilla extract and you can use like any kind. A lot of people, if you dig around in your parents' kitchen cabinets in the baking cabinet, you might see that your mom or dad has vanilla flavoring in there. You can put some of that in there. And if you had some ice, you could add some ice cubes to this too. Um, that'll make it kind of cold and like more like a popsicle, but, but that's it. That's all we're gonna do. So I'm gonna get this blended and here comes the loud part. <laughs> Well, our smoothie is made and we have some of our new friends here, uh, some kids who are in Community Bike Works who are gonna pour it for us and help us drink it and make it and hopefully love it. So, uh, what is your name, sir? My name's Jose. Jose? And Brianna. And Brianna? Shanique. And Shanique, all right. Well, Brianna, I think you are our pourer officially today. So if you wanna pour some of the drinks out and then we're all gonna try them. And one more thing that's so cool about this program that is near and dear to my heart is that they have a free book program, James. Can you tell us about that? That's right. It, it's kind of a branch off of our earn a bike theme, but this mm -hmm. time they're earning a book. That's so cool. And what so, does that mean? How do they, how do they get a book? <laughs> um, they get a book by receiving tutoring that's one-on-one -on -one from college students at Cedar cool. Crest. And um, what they have to do is they have to put in 18 hours 
of the tutoring and then they get to go to a bookstore and actually choose a book. <gasps> Really? So. Well, that sounds like heaven on earth to me. I love everything about this. You guys are doing awesome stuff. Are you having fun? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> well, don't look so scared. Here, have a drink. Maybe they need some energy after all the building bikes all day long. Here you go. All right. To you, sir. Oh, thank you. All cheers. <laughs> We'll cheers to Community Bike Works, and we hope you guys will check out more about Community Bike Works on their website. 